What's up guys, so today I'm doing something a little bit for a video today, so today I thought I'd react to all your unpopular opinions today, so I did a video like this like a year ago where I reacted to loads of your unpopular opinions and boy they were a really weird. So I found some more like unpopular opinions today which I thought I might react to today and give my view on these opinions today, so I don't know why it's like blue t-shirt just like going on with my jackets, um hello straight and that's a lot of yeah. So yeah, that's the video today, so hope you guys are excited, if you are, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, do all the things. Yeah, it's going to be a really weird video, so let's get started, shall we? <laughs> okay, so I've got all your unpopular opinions here right now, so let's have a look at them, shall we? Okay, so I'm using my laptop to get all the unpopular opinions, because I'm using my laptop. But it looks so weird. I look, why do I look professional? Like, why does it look so professional, just me, like, posing with, like, laptop, just being here? Like, this looks so professional for some reason, like, oh my god. Okay, first unpopular opinion is, let me ask my husband, is not oppression, it's a flex. Okay, so I don't really know what oppression actually means, so let me just like search it up. I probably will do, but I'm not, or maybe I just can't remember what it means. I'm still here. Two hours later. Okay, so oppression means a load of things, so one means that it's a prolonged, cruel, or unjust treatment of or exercise of authority, or the state of being subject to oppressive if treatments so are response to collective poverty or oppression or mental pressure or distress. So I presume it's the mental pressure or distress kind of thing. To be honest, maybe it kind of is to say, like, let me ask my husband because it just like implies that you've got a relationship that's like, I guess, healthy. Um, but I'm not sure. I mean, I wouldn't mind because maybe their husband knows something that the person, the other person doesn't. So I don't really see it as anything really. I just see it as, oh, well, maybe her husband might know more better than the person. I don't know. Unpopular opinion. You don't need to focus on spending less money. You need to focus on making more money. Oh my god, yes. Let me just put it out here. I agree with that one because I think, yes, spend the money on what you want, but because at the end of the day, like, if you've worked hard for it, like, for example, you weren't it through jobs or whatever you do, then yes, as long as you're able to pay bills or rent or mortgage or whatever you paying that money. Then yes, you should spend wherever you want. And on the basis of like not focusing on spending less money, but focusing on making more money. Yes, I agree. I think if you really want to get like the nicest things, such as maybe a Gucci handbag or any other nice things, then you should go out your way and work for it. You know, do loads of things because there's plenty of like jobs or plenty of like opportunities to make money out of things so you can like buy all those nice things so yeah so i think if you want nice things then i would say get the nice things but make sure you just earn um, the money to get these nice things like you can never have too much money so yeah i do kind of agree with that statement you know you should focus less on not spending as much money but focus more on like earning more money so you can spend the money which you earn more so i don't know does that explain well i don't know i'm not really good at explain that but that's my view on it next um Popular opinion, Ariana Grande's best album. So what's the song? Okay, so K by for now. That's off Sweetener, so yeah, the Sweetener album is one of my favourite like Ariana Grande albums. Like the songs are just on there are just like so good. Like I just love like all the songs in there. So yeah, so I do think Ariana Grande's Sweetener album is the best out there. But I like a bit of Positions or Thank You Next, you know, all those kind of albums as well. So but I think the Sweetener album was one that was really good. Unpopular opinion, hot chocolate is better than coffee. Okay. So I think it depends on like what you're doing. So for example, like if you want like hot drink, but you don't need like any energy, then yes, hot chocolate is really good. Like I love me some hot chocolate. Like I can't wait for autumn and winter and just like go outside and go for a walk in the nice crispy autumn leaves, you know, and get muddy and maybe go to a pumpkin patch and then go somewhere and get a nice hot hot chocolate like that sounds like a dream to me but if I don't need any like energy then yes hot chocolate is so freaking good and I feel like you have to have good hot chocolate as well like I love the dairy milk hot chocolate the one where we have, where we have like pour milk in it like that's my favourite hot chocolate especially with like cream and marshmallows as well so good but you guys know me and you know that I love coffee like I love iced coffee like I have iced coffee near enough every day and I just like love all the kind of coffees like I love the frappuccinos the iced lattes coffee which you make at home you know just the normal kettle 
cold coffee. Like, I love me some good coffee, but I just like a mix of both, really. So it just depends on what I'm doing at the day. Like, for example, if I'm just going out for a walk, then yes, hot chocolate sounds pretty good. But if I'm just waking up and I need some energy to, you know, start the day of busyness, then yes, a coffee sounds pretty good. So I like both, is what I'm trying to say. On popular opinion, people of dark circles are actually really cute. Okay, so I presume you mean like the under eyes here, like the eye bags, so you can clearly see that I've got eye bags. So thanks for that, because I've always thought, oh my, why do I have such dark under eyes? Like what's going on with me? So thanks for saying that uh, my under eyes are cute. I'm not being sarcastic, like I'm actually really thankful you said that, because um, I've never really liked these under eyes, but at least somebody thinks they're cute, so thanks for that. Unpopular opinion, spaghetti bolognese is one of the worst dishes out there. <laughs> Oh my god, I cannot believe there's someone out there who hates spaghetti bolognese. Like, spaghetti bolognese is literally one of the best dishes out there. Like, I could literally kill to have a, have a spaghetti bolognese right now. I love pasta in general, but I love spaghetti bolognese, lasagnas, pasta bolognese. I just love pasta in general. Like, pasta is one of my favourite dishes. Like, you can literally do all kinds of pasta. You can make all kinds of sauces and explore different flavours and all that kind of stuff. But I love me some good old pasta or spaghetti bolognese. I think it's a great filling dish, especially with like garlic bread and other accomplishments. It's also good comfort food as well for autumn and winter. Like what could you go wrong with spaghetti bolognese? Like it's one of the best dishes out there. But um, yeah, I suppose people have opinions. Um. So yeah, I think that's actually it. So I thought there was like a load more, but turns out not, so that's pretty good. So I'm gonna just end this video here now guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you have, don't forget to like this video, subscribe, so share all the things. Wow, I spoke literally so fast then. What the hell? I bet you can get any of what I said then, but I was basically saying just subscribe, do all the things. Leave a like on this video, subscribe to my vlogging channel because I'm vlogging every single day on there. And subscribe to my TikTok as well, but not subscribe but follow. And I'll see you guys in another video, so bye!